Good morning and welcome to the Mike Show for Friday, November 18th, 2022. 27 degrees at 8.01 a.m. and I am your host, Fat Kamal. I'm a, sinner, I'm a sinner. I'm a tired sinner. Restless sleep again. Chest pains, back pains, elbow pains, arm pains, feet pains. Pretty much got everything going on today. Here with Brother Prince and Co-Star Samuel. Brother Prince and Co-Star Max. Max, Mike, Sam, and Sully all went outside. Elsie is upstairs. I think Mikey's back upstairs. I don't know where Sullivan is, and he hasn't been feeling good. Uh, he puked yesterday. I think it was him. I know Elsie did, but that was probably because we gave her a different flavor of treat last night. But Sully puked, too. He's been hacking a lot. And I need to get him in to see the doctor, I think. Oh, Bobby, I don't know. It seems like it might just be a hairball, but I just don't know. I've got doctor's appointments today down in West Branch. I'll be leaving here around 10, 10, 15 a.m. I've got to be there for 1.30. I don't know what the weather is going to be like or the roads, so I want to give myself enough time to get there. <clears throat> I'm not looking forward to driving down there, and I'm especially alone. It'd be me and God, I guess, so. Could have used a navigator, but don't really know anybody that I could have asked. Oh no, there's Mike Geek. Come on, Mike Geek. Mike, there goes the school bus. Now there's fucking snow out there on the road today. There's school, but the other day there wasn't any and they canceled it. I just, I don't get this shit. But what do I know? Everything's backwards now. Hey, come on, Mikey. Mikey crawled underneath the covers with me last night and gave me a good purr, didn't you, Bobby? Yeah, you did. And I am grateful for that. Curled up in my left arm. and What do you smell, Poppy? So, for a recap from yesterday, um, no city chickens or anything out there right now, by the way. But we didn't do nothing yesterday, did we, honeys? Didn't do any... Well, no, I did make some lentil soup. But other than that, it was just hanging out with the loves watching YouTube. I, I watched all five episodes of Philomena Kunk on Great Britain. Mikey, you're not pissing, are you? What are you doing, Poppy? Come on. And I would highly recommend watching those if you haven't. She is hilarious. I'll probably do more of that today because she's had several different series. and I've got one bookmarked about Shakespeare, Philomena Kunk, Philomena Kunk on Shakespeare. But it is hilarious. And with that, we're going to take a break. Welcome back, and I don't really mean that. Oh, so anyway, we did do some, cook some soup yesterday, like I mentioned, and uh, I cooked a squash, too, and ate that. That was really good. And what else did we do, honeys? I made some eggs and toast for breakfast. These guys are kind of on a hunger strike. We normally have Senior Plus 11, Senior 11 Plus food for them, and then... TD Dental Food. There's that Sullivan. Good morning, Sully. Come on. Come on, cuddle, honey. You doing all right? And we ran out of the 11 plus yesterday. Got a new bag of it. It's supposed to be delivered tomorrow. But I failed. I should have ordered it, I think, what, on Tuesday. And I would, we would have got it today, but I didn't order it until Wednesday. So these guys don't have what they normally like to eat. And... So, they're, they're on a hunger strike. It's interesting to note, though, that they're, they go through periods, you know, like you'll get a big bag of the 11 plus and then they don't want to eat it and it lasts a month and a half and all they want to eat is the TD food and then now they're in the other, the other uh, end of the spectrum. They're, 
nibbling at the TD here and there and then wanting me 11 plus all the time. Oh boy, am I scattered right now and do I feel empty? I feel like an empty shell. Yes, I do. Oh, Sammy, thanks for being here with me. And you too, Mackie. You too, Mackie. Oh, you sweethearts. So anyway, we're back again. Still here with Max. And Samuel. Oh, yeah. That vehicle out there belongs to my cousin Shannon. We swapped vehicles. She's going to let me use hers to drive down to West Branch today. I... I'm sure my truck would make it just fine, but I don't know. I just like to have a better vehicle. My my truck's got 243,000 miles on it. And so she stopped by last night and we chatted a bit and I gave her some soup and anyway. Yeah. West Branch is 90 miles away from here. I'm gonna give myself two and a half to three hours to get there. That way I can do recon if I get there early enough. Find where the place is I need to go to. I think before I even leave though, I'm gonna call and see if they're still open, not snowed out, whatever. There's something interesting, that chunk of snow from the roof. Is it gonna fall down? When is it gonna fall down? There's icicles forming there. They've already gotten longer since I've sat out here. I should say since we've sat out here and uh, yeah still nothing feeding out there I mean, just a little over a week ago we had almost 80 degree weather now we're at the other extreme this is early for this type of cold up here oh there's some city chickens flying by they're starting to fly around and gather. But yeah, I just am not ready for this type of cold yet. And although, when I was outside last night waiting for Shannon to come by and drop off the vehicle, it was nice and I would have liked to have gone for a walk and why I didn't, I don't know, but there it is. Well, here's some excitement. Maxie just moved. What are you thinking, Poppy? Oh, we're just just about finished with our third cup of coffee. We've had some city chickens do a flyby, but nothing out there feeding. Oh, oh, there's movement. There's movement. There goes Max, and there goes Sam. Oh, yeah. So anyway. Yeah, I'm going to have to get going. I'm going to make a pot of coffee to take with me. Probably a little thermos of soup for a lunch. And... Take a shower, get cleaned up, gather up all my medical information, and head down to West Branch. Oh boy. Well, we are back. We got a second carafe of coffee brewing for our road trip. The city chickens did come and feed while I was making that. Maxie just joined me. Maxie just joined me. Sully was out there. There's that Sullivan. He was upstairs with Elsie and Mike. <clears throat> How you doing, Poppy? Are you feeling all right, Bobby? God bless you. I love you and thank you. Yeah, I hope you're feeling all right. I hope that's just a hairball you got, Bobby. So anyway... I guess it's about time to close this thing out. We got to get going. And I will be glad when this trip is over and I'll be glad to be home with these loves. So, from the cold gray ashes and coals of my cold black heart, my broken, beaten, battered, bruised, bloodied, burdened, empty, hollow, cracked, shattered, hopeless, forsaken, and forlorn soul, piss off, happy Friday, and thanks for not tuning in. <laughs>